Hi, we are too jealous. I'm Luca. I'm Stepan. And you are watching Noise, Noise 11. 11. Welcome to Noise11.com. Stefan and Luca, two cellos. Good to have you here. And uh, traveling the world. Yes. Visiting, uh, visiting Australia for the very first time. First time in Australia. Yeah. We love it. And all because of a little thing called this. Called cello. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and let's talk about, you know, what everybody knows about, I guess, the, uh, the YouTube sensation. When you put a video up on YouTube of, of Smooth Criminal and like, Two weeks down the track, there's millions of views. So yeah. how, how did it come about? You just decided that you were just going to film you know, yeah, yourselves we, doing two cellos? But we uh, wanted to do something, uh, something, you know, that could attract many young kids to this instrument. Mm -hmm. Because cello is such a universal instrument. It can do so many stuff and that people are not aware of. And we basically wanted to do something something that would fulfill us and our needs because we are young, full of energy, adrenaline. We want to rock, you know. <laughs> and also we wanted to expand the possibilities of cello. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, uh, were you classically trained or have yeah. you always played rock music? No, never. We, I mean, we were growing up with classical music all our life. Mm. But we also listened to other music as well. Mm -hmm. and we just wanted to combine everything and that's how this crazy project <laughs> came about yeah <laughs> crazy project that's an interesting way of putting crazy it isn't project. it yeah so you uh, you met i guess uh when you were still in in school yeah in vienna no i mean we 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 met in a master class summer mm. master class in croatia but we were studying in different cities so for 10 years we didn't see each other very often you know and uh Last year, when I came to London, he was already there studying. I came to study uh, at the Royal Academy of Music, and that's when we started hanging out more, and that's when this idea came. Right. So, and and you're in Manchester. I was in London, then Manchester. Uh huh. Postgraduate. Yeah. So leaving home to head over to England must have been a big move then. Yeah, I mean, I was well, I was living by myself since I was 14 because even in high school I went to another city so I kind of got used to it mm. so it was not a too big shock to move to mm. another country when you uh, when you did that video for smooth criminal that got all the YouTube hits had you already signed with your record label at that point no no we just uploaded this video and that was it then offers started coming in from the because of the record video. labels you know mm -hmm. And uh, even Elton John, he, he saw the video and invited us. And uh, many TV shows like Ellen DeGeneres, George Lopez, uh, they invited us as well, just because of the video. And who got the call from Elton? Uh, I did. I was in, in London at the time. And uh, principal of Royal Academy, he told me that uh, Elton saw the video and he would like to speak with me. And then <laughs> did you believe him? <laughs> well, it's principle. You don't get called for principle. He wouldn't call for that. <laughs> to just make fun. It could be a fun. funny principle, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for these guys, I tell them Elton John rang. Yeah. And then he, call, <laughs> he called me on my mobile and he said he loves the video, the arrangement. And uh, he, wa he was impressed by how many views it had in such short period of time. And uh, then he... He just invited us to join him and his band mm. on tour. Had you uh, had you ever done an Elton John song? No, we didn't. With him, <laughs> with him yeah. <laughs> but by ourselves, no, because he uses lots of piano in his songs, so it's hard to, to capture the sound of his songs without the piano. Mm. Mm. Now, I would imagine that uh, you couldn't just do any song on the cello. No. So you must have chosen very carefully what yeah. you're going to put on this record. It has to suit on cello. Mm -hmm. As long as it has beautiful melody, the song, then it's more than likely it's going to suit on cello. Yeah. Well, you know, two tracks stand out to me, the Nirvana and also the Guns N' Roses track. So, again, you're talking about the melody. Was that what you heard in... Well, in those, those songs, it's something else. It's, it's riff, the, the energy, rock yeah. riff. Yeah. And the cello can do so many things. It can scream, rock it really can scream, hard. you know, like rock singer. Mm -hmm. 
it can rock really hard, it can sing, you know, so. But it's all the music that we listened before, you know, mm-hmm. uh, that we, we put on this album, music that we loved. and. Because uh, I guess the violin is, a, you know, a popular classical instrument that gets used a lot in rock music, isn't it? But you don't hear a lot of cello. No, you do. <laughs> <laughs> he does have a point there. Well, th- <laughs> there were uh, Finnish cellists called Apocalyptica. Mm-hmm. They, they covered some Metallica. They did metal from- mostly. Mm-hmm. And there have been a couple of the uh, the symphonic tours that have happened over the years, like Metallica actually yeah, sure, yeah. Metallica. Uh, worked with the San Francisco Orchestra at one point. Yes, and Sting, he does also lots of... And I mean, Elton, he also uses lots of string parts in his m- songs, mm-hmm. which we kind of adopted for cellos and we play with him. Yeah. Now, you've chosen two U2 songs on this record. Yes. Well, U2 is one of my favorite bands and... Uh, their songs are really emotional and uh, they rock really hard as well so underneath above is this great melody which is perfect for cello but underneath is also this energy and intensity which is great for cello and it's perfect Mm. and uh, apart from smooth criminal there's also uh, human nature another michael jackson song on there so were you jackson fans is that yeah i I used to listen to him a lot Mm -hmm. and and I like this pizzicato technique. We, uh, human nature is all pizzicato, so mm-hmm. it's, it's, yeah. it's different. Yeah. The uh, the use of Kings of Leon and Coldplay was a very interesting move too. Yeah, we needed to do something which is contemporary, more contemporary. I mean, artists who who perform nowadays, but who still follow the tradition of great bands from the past. You know, mm-hmm. still great music. Have you had any feedback from any of the artists that you've covered? Yeah, yeah. I mean, we. Uh, you know, choreographer who did the Smooth Criminal, he he emailed us the next day after the video came out. Mm-hmm. He said Michael would absolutely love it. We also had a chance to play with members of Michael Jackson band, and they also said it's a shame that he couldn't hear it. Mm. And also Guns N' Roses and Nirvana put it, our videos on their Facebook page, so it's great. Yeah. What What did you try that didn't make the album? Was well, there any, any well, we did like 20 demos, yeah, and then we just picked 12 songs. Well, all 20 could go, yeah. but we need so what, it's what, too much. <laughs> what were the songs that were left out? I mean, we decided we will do only cello at first album. No, Only two cellos. No any only guests, but if we could uh, add drums or something, we could do many ACDC and stuff, mm-hmm. which is my favorite. Right. <laughs> did, you, uh, did you actually demo an ACDC track? We tried, but it didn't work with two cellos only. Yeah. So with, with drums, it's perfect. What We're going to play tonight. What song? Highway to Hell, You Shook Me All Night Long. Oh, right. Thunderstruck. Yeah? So it's in, the, it's in your set list? Yeah, yeah. Wow. That'll go down very well in Australia. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so what is shaping up for 2012 for two cellos? New album. Already? Why not? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we st- towards the end of the year. It should be. Well, we will start good. recording it. Maybe it's going to be finished in 2020. <laughs> <laughs> like, so you're going to do a Guns N' Roses on us. Yeah, take 13 years to put your record out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> have, you, uh, have you actually thought what's going on to the second album? ACDC. <laughs> 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 Fantastic. We're looking forward to the two cellos do ACDC in, uh, in 2012. Well, it's great to uh, have you guys in here. There is the album, Two Cellos, uh, touring Australia with Elton John and the rest of the world next year, no doubt, and for many years to come. Thanks for joining Thank us you. here at Noise Thank 11. You.